But first, we did want to take you on a tour of the newest venue in the Mountain West Conference. Welcome to Snapdragon Stadium, home to the San Diego State football program. Built adjacent to the old, dilapidated, and now demolished Qualcomm Stadium, the venue opened in 2022, making it the newest in the Mountain West Conference. This place does a wonderful job of honoring the past and embracing the future. As you walk in, you will pass a statue of legendary sports writer, Jack Murphy. This was actually moved from Qualcomm to Snapdragon. Next to him is his dog, Abe, who Jack often referenced in his articles. Inside the stadium, you will notice a tribute to the late, great Tony Gwynn. Inducted into the MLB Hall of Fame in 2007, he is one of the purest hitters to have ever lived. He is Mr. Aztec, having played here and coached here. He also left behind a simple message reminding everybody to play hard and have fun. Looking around the stadium, you will notice a few Easter egg seats. These were actually brought over from the old stadium to the new Snapdragon Stadium. This row of seats is honoring Aztec superfan Tom Abel, an honorary inductee into the SDSU Hall of Fame who passed away in 2017. Abel witnessed 788 games over his final 62 years of life. The actual playing surface here is named Basher Field, after booster Diane Basher, who donated $15 million to this project. She helped jumpstart this 35,000 seat, $310 million stadium that is also the home to professional soccer, rugby, lacrosse, high school sports, and concerts. As you can see, Snapdragon Stadium is beautiful. It's been viewed as a success, but they did take a little bit of heat right out of the gate when they opened the doors in 2022. When San Diego State kicked off against Arizona, they did so under sweltering 100 degree heat. Ambulances and fire trucks had to be brought in to treat some 200 people suffering with a heat illness. And a handful of those had to go to the hospital. The main complaint, was a lack of shade. The good news for Bronco Nation, conditions will be cool and calm at kickoff tonight. 